And so you're, you're right in everything you say, but I, I don't, so where I've grown in the sense of, like when I tried to run the event earlier in the year and nobody came to it, to me, I processed that wrong. Whereas now what I do is, I don't have any expectation or attachment to the outcome. So for me, it, making this video is me living my purpose. Mm. It doesn't matter if one person watches it or a million people watches it. I just believe my job is really just to create and to share. And as long as I'm creating and sharing, then I'm on my purpose. So it doesn't matter about the external thing, about whether people are watching or not. And I think that also, you don't need a purpose. But for me, I enjoy it. And I, I personally enjoy it. And I think that the times in my well, life... and how you enjoy it? I feel much better when I feel like my life has direction and has focus. Right, and okay. it's something that I'm working towards, which is essentially bigger than myself. Right. Oh, yeah, no, I can relate to that in some sense. Yeah. Like, for example, when I'm... The times I struggle in my life, and we spoke about this quite extensively, is, that, is when, when I stop doing this, when I stop my public speaking, when I stop making the videos, when I stop writing, I turn to alcohol and start drinking again. But when I'm doing this, I know that I have to be the best version of myself. So it helps me stay sober, it helps me be fit, healthy, and I just feel much better when I've got a bit of focus and direction in my life. And so I know that when I'm working towards something, it just makes me feel better. So you're right in the sense of you don't need a purpose, but I think I'm also right in the sense that purpose can help you.